What's going on, guys? Hey, see, I did a video earlier, and I wish I hadn't have done that one because, see, I didn't see all the shit that was going on until after I put it up. Because I did kind of a joking video, joking around, and that's kind of the problem. We've we've let them. We let them say what the fuck ever they want. They trash us, and, you know, we don't respond back. And if we do, it's, you know, we try to keep it, you know, I guess PC. That shit's over. Fuck that. I ain't doing it no more. The only thing about it is if if something's on something and we don't watch it, we don't know what they say. And if it's if it's bad enough, of course they private it. Like, you know, that's that's even funny tonight because it's like when uh Roy was trying to get Tracy to private the stream and she was like, Oh no, I don't care if they clip it. Tracy, you dumbass, he wasn't doing it for you. He wasn't trying to help you. He was up there whining and crying like the little bitch he is. He was crying, he was saying a bunch of lies, a bunch of bullshit. He wants he didn't care what it did to your channel. Do you not think how Roy's not been on his channel screaming, cussing, going at Bobby? When he does it on his channel, he's very fucking mild about it. He doesn't give a fuck what happens to your channel. You know, you belong with those type of people, though, Tracy. That's who you went at because you keep on saying like people's talking about you from uh the shit Cherry College. You Tracy, the reason it's got nothing to do with what Cherry called you. No one gives a fuck. At the time we did, and we went to bat for you. You retch out everything. You didn't want to go to certain channels. You couldn't help it. You was going to leave YouTube. We stood up for you, and over a fucking wrench, you you turned on us. And it wasn't just that. What it was, it was because of, like, Eric's channel. You know, Cherry was coming around. Uh, you kind of seen, like, oh, shit, you had Trout there. Eric, they're flying the fucking Bobby. At that time, he was, they, all three of them had the Cherry icons. You said you couldn't even stand to go in there. You woke up and seen it, and it ruined your day. So, I, I don't know. It's amazing how a wrench can change your whole thing and plus i guess at that time you thought eric was uh i don't know what the fuck you i don't know if you thought you was his mom i have no idea but only thing we've ever said about eric on this side of things is the truth like you know the shit that he lets happen on his channel the shit you know the people he lets around they they end up fucking him over i mean you not remember the story where people tried to warn him about that one dude and eric's on vacation in north carolina he shows the restaurant he's at and the fucking guy calls it that's psycho behavior. If Eric would have listened, he wouldn't deal with that. With Cherry sitting there calling Eric names, uh, R word, saying shit about his girlfriend that I won't repeat here. Because like I said, no, you know, I, I have no ill will toward Eric. I really don't. Because Eric is one, he's a, he's a people pleaser. Bobby, if you're hearing this, kind of like you. Because what I've seen tonight, Bobby, is that's kind of why, you know, I'll, I'll just be honest. That's why I'm not on the panel right now. When You know, I can't sit there and say, oh, Bobby did well because you didn't, Bobby. You, you'll say you stay out of stuff, but you ever think about taking a stand within this? If we're lying and saying something, Bobby, call us out. Please do it. Tell us. Don't say like, oh, well, you talk and they talk. Mention what we're talking about. If we're saying shit like Roy did this, Reese did this, and it's a lie, Serb did this, tell us. No, 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 that's not true. But if you're over there and they're saying bullshit, call it out, Bobby. That's all you got to do. It would end it. See, if like I've, I've told you this before, Bobby. If when Serb was sitting there saying all that shit tonight about Oh, they said let it go, and you know, and I tried to telling him to let it go. No one's ever told him to let anything go. We told him to fucking sh shut up, and we would leave him alone. We tried to do it, but you know what, Bobby? We can't do it because he talks shit. Your girl Tracy gives him a channel to talk shit on all night long. During the day, he goes wherever he can go. I think it's there now, to be honest. But he talks shit the entire day. All bullshit. All lies. And see... One of your biggest outs, Bobby, is you'll say, well, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Oh, I don't really care. It's not my business. When somebody puts shit on YouTube like he did, saying, you know, he's lost to see. He's been missing. That's the third time he's went missing. Literally, it's always the family can't get a hold of him. They're worried. I mean, think about it. That dude's fucking psycho, man. I mean, I've seen him on other channels today saying stupid shit like he's got connections all over. No, he doesn't. He's a fucking idiot. I mean, anybody can call a fucking place and say, hey, there's a guy who needs help. Can you help him? But he, he's got to make it look like he's got fucking ends around the country. If he's got all these fucking people that he knows at these high positions, why in the fuck ain't, well, he, he ain't working with them? Why is he driving around all day in his fucking car bitching and whining? I don't know. That's like, you know, and Bobby, like, see, again, you heard, you literally heard Roy tell you that Reese has everything. Oh, I don't know if you guys know this, but Reese has everything. He's got everything everybody's ever said. Like Roy's riding Reese's nuts. And I used to think it was the opposite way around. But now, nah, Roy's kissing Reese's ass. It's fucking sad to watch. But again, he said that Flex said that Flex himself bought his subs. 
Roy said he has him admitting it. He has him admitting it. Well, he didn't well, link us to it. Instead of putting us, you know, linking uh, or tagging us, I mean, in fucking stupid ass videos about walking through a music store a year ago. Reese, why don't you tag us in those videos? Call us out. That's what I'm saying, Bobby. I'm literally saying to you, if we say something, just like if I'm saying this to Reese right now, Flex never said that he purchased his own subs. He said it was bought for him just the way it was bought for you. And just the way Roy said back then it was bought for him when uh, Roy went from, what, 700 to like 1400 something like that, a little bit less, overnight. But you notice when that happened, Roy didn't get in contact with YouTube on that. Kind of weird, ain't it? But if you think about it, Bobby, if Reese got all that, why don't he put it up there? Why don't he put it out? Show us. He could literally put that up against Flex and end them. But, Bobby, the funny thing about that is if you go back on Reese's channel about three months ago, you will hear him calling you, Roy, and Flex liars saying you guys admitted that you bought your own subs that's reese i have i have him saying it he's got it he says all that and we take up for you bobby we literally sit there and say shit like uh oh bobby didn't say this bobby didn't do that roy shouldn't have brought this up roy shouldn't have done this but you don't do bobby you go over there I'm, I'm not going at you bobby i swear to god i'm just saying we keep on that's like look at torp look at the shit they done to torp see a lot of people you know you don't really think about it because if you it's somebody else. It's not you, right? Just imagine if you woke up a day and you got on the internet and you seen a video and it was about you and two little girls. Knowing in your life before that somebody had done the same lie to you and it, you know, fucked up your life. Yeah, you'd be pretty pissed too. And I mean, what Torp does, I mean, he should, whatever he does, it's probably not enough because he should go all out on that. What they done to him was fucking bullshit, Bobby. Why don't you ask Roy about that? Like, <clears throat> excuse me. Why don't you like ask him why he keeps letting Reese up there and knowing that way? And if, you know, Reese, I think he did take the video down. I'm, I'm going to swear on that. But then he put the one about Dylan up. That's another thing. They go with Dylan to try to fuck with him about that. Reese knows Dylan's not racist. He knows that, but he shows it and he calls him racist in the video. Now you got Dylan then saying he uses his disability for a, a, a crutch. Literally says it. Reese, what the fuck are you talking about? Have you ever heard Dylan do that? No. I mean, never. It, it takes a low motherfucker to go at him like that. And people who let that guy around, they're just as bad. If Reese does that, he comes up on a panel, and you let him up there, even if he's not talking about that, he's there. So all that shit on his channel, you must agree with or you wouldn't have him up there unless you were, you know, asking him about it. But why don't you all do that? Once you ask Reese, like, hey, do you really think Dylan's racist? Hey, do you really think Torp's what he is? Then let Reese give his opinion. It's hot facts, but he has no facts. I'm just saying it's, you know, it's, it's at the time where being nice about shit, not bringing this up or not bringing that up or not watching this. It can't happen no more. If, if we miss something, they say, that's the problem. Somebody will come over and they'll say, hey, did you see that? And we're like, no, nah, we didn't see it. It was like a week ago. And they're saying they said this and that. And we go back and look and the video's gone. It's gone or private or they deleted it or whatever. And now we just having to go on what people say. So if we do misspeak on something, like if someone told us something and they messed it up a little bit and we said like, hey, you said this about us and it, maybe that person got it a little bit wrong. Now it looks like we're lying. So that's the thing. It's best to see that shit yourself so you can go back at them. But again, it's, I know it's, you know, people say, oh, guilt by association. How many times you heard Roy say that? It's bullshit guilt. And the first thing Roy said to you today, Bobby, was, oh, my God, you're up on that panel. And everything he said was a lie. There you go, Bobby. I'll take it for you. Bobby has never talked shit about Roy ever that I heard of, ever. I have never been on a panel with Bobby or Bobby's ever been in the chat where I've seen it. And he's never said a negative thing about you, Roy, ever. But then you'll sit there and tell Bobby he shouldn't, you know, his opinion, you know, it's none of his business and everything. But then when you say something. And Bobby said, he's like, you're like, well, I'm allowed to think what I want. So you're allowed to do what you want. But fuck Bobby. Is that right, Roy? That's your problem. That's why you are where you're at, Roy. You only care about yourself. You're a fucking liar. You're a terrible person. And you're a shit friend. I mean, you admitted you you admitted you're a liar. You said for the last three months you were in flex, was, your friendship was over. But you was coming up there laughing, having the time of your life. You was accepting him, sending people to your lives. In that three-month period, how many times did he put the link and say, hey, it's, we're over at Roy's. Come on over here. I don't, you know, I thought back. I've never seen you say, hey, let's all go to Flex. I've never seen that. 
I have seen you when people have said, hey, I got a live going tomorrow or later tonight. You will go off and threaten to block them saying how rude it is to uh, say something about their channel or their thing without asking the channel owner. And you'll do it to flex. I mean, you will literally come in the lounge. Got a live starting in 30 minutes. And what will flex do? He won't be like, Roy, you're fucking blocked. The dude will be like, oh, okay, cool. Then right at the time, he's like, hey, Roy's live. Let's go over there. And he puts a link to your fucking channel. And you struck the motherfucker and took that channel down. You had a friend like Flex. And you traded it for fucking Reese. That says all you need to know. You deserve the losers you're with. The people we got on this side, damn good people. We just got to get together and stop, you know, giving people passes. That's our problem. We let everybody slide. We we try to take, and that's the good thing. I say, I, I've said this about Flex many times. His best quality and worst quality is, is the person he is. Now, see, if, if this microphone's a little messed up, I'm blaming Tort because he just hardened my comment, and it fucks up my mic. See you in court, Tort. But anyway, Flex will literally forgive easily. He'll let shit go forever. Even if he knows it's kind of hurting him or his channel, he will give the person a benefit of the doubt. But that's why people like Flex, because he's that person. But also him being that person fucks him over a lot of times. Because you got people like Roy, Reese, I mean several others. Most of the people in that chat, they will literally take advantage of Flex being nice to them. They'll take advantage of them. Then when Flex finally gets to the point where he's done with it, then they get mad at Flex and you know say all that shit. So I'm going to end it like this. You know, everything I've ever said... I'll show, if I said something and you're like, oh, no, 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 I'll show it. Now, you, Bobby, this is to you. You heard Roy say tonight, Reese has everything. Reese has it all, right? There you go. Reese, tag us in the videos. Tag us in anything you said. Torp, I'm suing you double now, buddy. Y'all blame Torp again because every time that little notification comes on, it fucks up my mic. But anyway, Reese, tag us and all that shit. I would really love to see it. Really would. Put it this way. If you say I said something I didn't say and I said it, I will make a fucking video apologizing. There you go. Now, Serb, you lie to the entire community. You keep shit going. You go around behind channels starting shit, trying to act like one person, one place, one person, another. You're a piece of shit liar. You, Your whole YouTube existence is a lie. Your buddy dog, your alternate person, he's gone. You're so embarrassed now that you don't even bring him around. You just use it. I mean, that's another thing. He, he'll sit there and talk on, like, comments about, like, you know, Flex should just take responsibility and shit because he's, but you're playing videos of us. Dude, I could strike the fuck out of you. You're using my picture and your alternate and you're you're doing it as YouTube would say, uh, bullying harassment. I've been told many times, I'm like, nah, I don't give a fuck. Do it. I don't care. Keep doing it. I don't give a fuck. Sir, listen really good. You and, uh, do you like channel dog? I don't know how you do it, but do that and I, tell dog, I won't, you know, strike him. I'm not going to strike none of you. I don't care. If I say something and you guys play it, I'm glad. Now, if you alter, I ain't talking about the funny songs. I mean, shit, some of them is kind of funny, sir. I'll give you that. But you ever thought about this, sir? If you would come out and just admit, like, hey, I, I got a lot of shit started. I lied a lot. I shouldn't have done it. I'm sorry. Shit would move on. Because, sir, like I said, starting out, you wasn't a bad guy. I mean, I knew you was full of shit for a long time, but there was no need to call you out. Not until what you got started at the lounge. You had a whole nother channel, a whole other group of people, which they dwindled down to nothing now. But you had them attack and flex over a fucking lie. That you came back and confirmed. You show pictures of a soldier and a dog saying it's you. Many times you showed that picture. Many times. I shouldn't say mess. I don't lie. I've seen at least three times that you sh you know showed pictures and told stories and shit. And it's all bullshit. It's all bullshit. And then you'll say that you did it to troll us. Well, how was you trolling us? Because we never talked about you. The only time we ever talked about you was taken up for you against Ricky and Ron. We should have never done that because they proved what they were saying was true. They were in the right, and we're literally like, oh, Serb wouldn't do that. Serb don't mess with nobody, but you all know it's bullshit. So, Bobby, the next time you're on the panel, he's sitting there, you know, oh, my God, I just think it's weird. Ask him, say, is it more weird that you fucking told people you was lost at sea? Then you come back and say, oh, it's a, you know, it's a family problem. Why should I have to explain? You don't have to explain, sir, but quit talking shit. You also didn't have to make a fucking lie and tell by all this other bullshit. Oh, I've been shot three times in my prior life and one time of this one. This is me and my dog, Cerberus. You're full of shit, sir. You are full of shit. That's a fact. I can show you saying all that. I can show you the time where I really, I swear to God, Hector almost had a fucking moment where he fucked up and called you out on it. Jerry caught it. He shut down Hector and went on. Because, dude, imagine, he's got that shit on his channel, a picture of you. 
it's like he's proud to have you there because you're this soldier. And, dude, I've even told you, like, on Veterans Day one time, hey, thanks for your service. And I have no fucking idea if you ever served. If you did, even if you was a fucking cook or a mechanic and you never did no – it's still – it's okay. You served your country. But you got to make up a story about you're running around the goddamn desert with a dog. I don't know. Hey, you ought to get that dog channel and hit up Reese. Reese really loves dogs. But anyway, like I said, all you guys got to do is start calling out the bullshit on both sides. If we say something you think is a lie, ask us to prove it. We will. If they say something. See, Bobby, I seen a comment where you literally said a little while ago, like, the text didn't say nothing like Roy was saying. So there you go. Roy lies his ass off. He gets on a panel crying like a bitch. And he tells, you know, trying to make it sound like, oh, everybody's so mean to him. But he's lying his ass off. He's literally sending you shit. And, and saying it's something that it's not. Now watch, Bobby. When he finds out, he was there tonight. When he sees you tell the truth about that, he's going to say not that you were telling the truth, that you lied. Like, Bobby, if I said something, like if I said Serb was lost, you know, wasn't lost to sea, the Coast Guard wasn't looking, which I 100% know that, Bobby. And you, you say, well, I don't, I don't, I don't. Trust me, Bobby. It's easy to find out. You can look it up in 10 seconds. And you might say, well, I don't care. I don't care. This is just entertainment. It's not being, it's not very entertaining right now, is it, Bobby, with all this shit going on? It's not entertaining at all. And them lies call it. So if you see me, if, if I say anything and you think, I don't know if that's true, ask me and I'll prove it. Ask him if they'll do the same thing. And remember, Reese has got everything Roy told us. So, Reese, I'm going to expect you to tag me in a bunch of bullshit that you said about me. Please tag me in it. Roy, go fuck yourself. Reese, go fuck yourself. God damn it. That was Reese. Now we're going to fucking see Reese just tag me again. I don't know what it was, but it probably fucked up my mic. Way to go, Reese. See? I guess you got that Bobby thing. If I mention your name, you fuck shit up. Actually, Reese, you just fuck shit up on the daily. But, Bobby, I'm telling you, I'm not going at you here, Bobby. I swear to God. I'm just saying, if you would call off the bullshit on both sides, but there is no bullshit here, Bobby. Like I said, we'll prove that. Problem it is, you go up on a panel, and they sit there and lie their ass off. You'd be like, whoa, whoa, whoa. That lets people think that what they're saying could be true. It might, you know, call that shit out. They said they have it, so let's see it. We'll be waiting for that, Reese. Thank you. Y'all go fuck yourselves. The rest of y'all have a good night.